Hello everyone, my name is Roya and today I will be telling you all about the books that I plan to read in the month of August. So the months of June and July have not been that great reading progress wise. I mean, I've, the books I've been reading have been good, but um, I haven't been reading anywhere near as many books as I normally do. So that has been a huge bummer. Um, a lot of it is just because I'm so like depressed a lot of the time about and not really, you know, just kind of anxious about the uncertainty of the situation and what's going on in the world and all of that. Um, so I spend a lot more time looking at the news or like not being able to get out of bed or just whatever um, than actually reading any books. And also I've been trying to get a copywriting business going so I've basically just been really starting it's like studying up on copywriting and trying to get some good writing samples done so that I can build a website and have all of that going. So it's been really, really difficult right now um, for me just personally in my life, but I am still reading as much as I can. So anyway, um, mostly I'm just going to start with the books that I am currently reading. So I am currently reading Ray Bearer by Jordan Ifwiko. This uh, is... A book that comes out in August. I am just a couple of chapters into it at the moment and I definitely hope this is basically one of my first priorities this month is to finish this book for sure. Then I also am curr currently reading Night's Shadow by Sebastian de Castell. I uh, did read a little bit more of this book this uh, past month so that's good. I started this book um, at the beginning of the lockdown actually like right after losing my job and right after the lockdown happened I picked up this book and read like like a couple chapters and then totally just had too much else to read and too much else going on and didn't end up getting to the rest of it. So I've been making like super slow progress just every once in a while picking it up and I really need to just hurry up and read the rest. So yeah, it is really, really good. I'm just in such a like messed up state of mind that I can't seem to like sit down and read for long periods of time at all. So I don't know what's going on there. So I do have some review books. I do have some other things. I need to get to. I have some copywriting books that I still need to get to. Um, just all kinds of stuff and I have no idea how much I'm going to be actually able to read this month and how much I will not be. So I'm really not going to go into every little thing that I want to read but we do have the TBR jar which is of course everyone's favorite part. So I'm going to just pick a book title out of this jar and we'll just see what it says and hopefully I will get to it this month. So actually two books, uh, two uh, pieces of paper actually just fell out of the TBR jar with book titles on them. So those two book titles are Ancillary Justice by Anne Leckie and Son of the Shadows by Juliette Morillier. So I'm going to try to get to both of, both of these because that's just how it works. That's the rules of the TBR jar um, for me anyway. That's how, what I determine the rules of the TBR jar to be. So Son of the Shadows is the sequel to uh, Daughter of the Forest by Juliette Morillier and I read Daughter of the Forest a couple of years ago already and I still haven't read the rest of the series so I need to get on that and then Ancillary Justice is um a book that I actually got at the very end at the very beginning of the year it was like the first my first book that I acquired in 2020 and I have been meaning to get to it ever since like it has been at the top of the list ever since and I've just had too much else to get to as well so um yeah hopefully now that I've gotten it out of the TBR jar it'll motivate me to read it this month so anyway those are the books that I plan to read in the month of August let me know what your thoughts are if you've read any of these have any thoughts on them and what book are you most excited to read in August and I will see you very soon with a new video bye